that's cool. Oh, I like that. That's cool. Come here, bubs. Do you like this? Do you want this? You want it? No. You want it? For Christmas? No. No? <laughs> I'm just teasing. I would never do this to myself, banned in a box. <laughs> I saw these on Amazon for 30 bucks. And I'm not sure how much it is here. Oh, 40. Yeah. I will not be getting those here. This is cute. Isn't this? Do you like this? Let's see if he likes it. Bubsy, do you like this? Yeah. Do you want that for Christmas? Okay, not, not interested in that. Okay. So that was just some footage of me and uh, my toddler in the mall looking at toys and I actually didn't buy anything that day because well he was with me number one and I just wanted to see what he liked so I know what to get him for Christmas. I don't feel like I went overboard because he's at that age where he's just starting to get Christmas and understand that people get gifts and um, he doesn't really get it and also yeah he doesn't have anything specific that he wants like I know he likes Paw Patrol I know he likes Spider-Man so I'm getting things based on his interests but he doesn't specifically want anything and as I get older you know that some of the things that they want are, are really expensive like I have um, three uh, step kids two are 12 they're twins two boys and then the 15 year old who's also a boy and one of them the 12 year old asked for a Gucci belt like that is on his Christmas list and so um, I was like, you know, just just a heads up, you, you're probably not gonna get that. Like that's five hundred dollars for a belt. Like, come on, that's like a luxury item. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I was telling my husband about it. He's like, I'm gonna get him a Gucci belt. I said, you're gonna pay five hundred dollars on a belt for this twelve year old kid. <laughs> He's like, no, no, I can get it for thirty bucks. I was like, oh, a replica. <laughs> you know what I mean? But whatever. Anyway, so I. Uh, here is the box I got from Amazon. And like I said, I don't feel like I went overboard. Yeah, the older they get, the more expensive their stuff are, eh? The things that they want. <laughs> but that's all good. I get it. That was the same way. Ugh. All right, my son's upstairs and he, oh no, he's crying, oh no. oh no, oh no. I gave him my phone to kind of play with, but ooh. anyways, let's make this quick. So uh, last year he got a Play-Doh set with letters and um, I, took it from him because I wanted to give the oh Bubza come here Bubby I'm gonna have to do this later <laughs> and I'm back his uh, older brother came to the rescue so he has him oh uh, yeah it's so hard to film especially this video where it's stuff for him I don't want him to see it obviously right so anyway so last uh, year he got a, a play-doh set of letters and um, I took it from him this year to give to my students because they had letter stampers and things like that. And I thought, oh, my students will like this. And so I have the empty box here and he, um, he, he takes the box and he says, Play-Doh, Play-Doh. And then it's empty and he's like, done, done. And I just feel bad <laughs> that I did that. So I got him this. Um, it's not quite the same as the, yes. <laughs> Just give me five minutes. I'll be five minutes. I'll be five minutes. <laughs> I, I thought it was so slick. I woke up early this morning to film this, and then now everyone's up. Woo! Like, come on. Jeez. Anyways, um, so yeah, so I got him this to, uh, it's not the same thing, but I got him this, you know, to reinforce the letters and the, the numbers and all that. So that's cute. He likes Play Doh. Next, I got, oh, I forgot how much that was. I think it was like $13. I don't remember. And then I got, he's starting to get into Spider-Man. So 
I saw this uh, Duplo Spider-Man kit and I thought he would like this. Uh, I showed him a, a video of someone unboxing this on YouTube and he was really excited. So that's how I kind of test if you'll like something, like his reaction to watching videos, you know? 2017, right? <laughs> so uh, yeah, I got him that. I don't remember how much this was. I want to say $13, but I don't know, 15 maybe? I don't remember, something around there. One of those T numbers there. And then uh, when I went shopping with him, I noticed that he likes things with beeping and lights and all of that, which, which kid doesn't really. But I got him this um, VTech Text and Go learning phone and it was $8. Like the regular price was 17, but it was eight bucks. So I was really excited to see this and you know, I think he'll have fun with it. It looks like a little tablet. Uh, yeah, so that looks like fun. And then of course, this cannot be complete without some Paw Patrol. My child is obsessed with Paw Patrol. So I got this. Um, it's in a, let me take off the plastic. So he has the, um, the dogs, like he has Chase, he has Rubble, but he doesn't have Ryder. So I got him Ryder's Rescue ATV and, um, yeah, I think he'll, he'll enjoy this one. Obsessed with Paw Patrol. And then when I went into, um, the, the store I showed you, which was the Bay, uh, they had those pots, that pot set and they were 40 bucks and they were like the stainless steel looking realistic pots and my my child he likes to pretend to cook and do all that stuff so that was way too expensive and then on amazon had the exact same melissa and doug set but those were 30 which i still thought was a lot so i also i found a different one on amazon for 20 dollars, and it comes in this little pouch and i mean it's cute look at that and it comes with, it even comes with the little cooking utensils. I mean, they're tiny, but I, I, I need it to be tiny because he has a kitchen, those little tykes kitchens, and it's small. So uh, this, this is the perfect size. Um, and it comes with a little bag to store it in. So that's nice. His, his kitchen came with things. It, ooh. <laughs> his kitchen came with things. It came with plates and spoons and it came with canned food. But after a while, those things start disappearing. Like, I don't know what happened to them. I don't know if like we gradually just kind of threw them out and now he doesn't have anything left or if they're in the toy box, I, I don't know where they are. But anyway, that's fine. And then I got him this mess-free uh, Paw Patrol Color Wonder. And I got it for like on the go. Like when we're out, he can color. He likes stickers. That's what we do when we're on the go and he's on the bus with me. But I thought this would be fun as well. And this is gonna be from Santa. And my child hates brushing his teeth. Like whenever I have to do it, it's like this dramatic thing. So I got this, um, I got this uh, toothbrush. It's a spin brush, but it's kind of big. On the internet, it looks like, it looked like it was like half the size. Like I thought it was a tiny thing, but um, I don't know. I'm gonna have to use my discretion with this. Uh, yeah, I hope it, I hope it's, it's good for him. But anyway, soft bristles and it should be fine. But I figured he might like to brush his teeth because it's Paw Patrol and it's a spin brush. So anyways, we'll see. So I got that. These are from Santa. I don't know <laughs> what it is, but like, I know, I know some families gifts from Santa are these big things like Santa got you the American Girl doll or the PlayStation. I'm like, Santa's not getting credit for those big items, okay? <laughs> like Santa got you the coloring book and the crayons and the tub of Play-Doh, but he did not buy you the Xbox 360. That was from mom and dad, you know what I mean? <laughs> but anyways, uh, stock and stuffers. And then these I got at the dollar store. I was at the dollar store the other day and I saw them and I went, oh, let me just add this. Um, these Mashems, it says four years plus, but he does have a car Mashems and I mean, I have to watch him with it. I'm not that confident that he won't put it in his mouth, but he doesn't really put things in his mouth. So there's that. And then I saw this at the dollar store, which is like one of those, remember Magna Doodles? It was kind of like that. And I was actually looking at these on Amazon, but they were a little pricey. So I didn't end up getting it. But uh, yeah, 
dollar store. So, yep. Stocking stuffers and everything else. I'm just gonna uh, wrap up for him. So that's it. That is all the things that I got my toddler for Christmas. And I actually also got one more thing. I got this remote control car. And um, it's for toddlers. It was 20 bucks and it the reviews were solid so I just decided to get him that like because he loves cars and uh yeah everyone said my toddler can manage it like they can make it move and it's great so I, it just didn't arrive yet so and I wanted to just film this video so I'll insert a picture if I can figure out how to do that <laughs> um but yeah that's it if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe if you like my channel i'll see you all in my next video bye